Aloha. Hey. Uh, yep. I know it's been a minute since I've posted a video. Uh, a lot has happened. Uh, so for one, I lost my office, right? I had, uh, had my, uh, my niece came and visited me and uh, she stayed with us for a couple months. And, uh, and I ended up moving to have to move out in the cat room. And so my desk was, was like over there. I was really not. <laughs> it sucked. Anyway, so I just got moved back in. And, um, and just a little update of what, where I am. And, but the most questions I've seen to... Uh, be asked is about this uh, this acronym uh, flow whatever I forget what it's called but it's the acronym ROG acronym something it's that tablet um, it's uh, it's this thing it so yeah this thing's freaking amazing it's super awesome it, I mean it's really heavy but but it'll literally do anything you want it to do you can game on it you can do anything um, it's really super powerful. Uh, it is the second most powerful device I have, right? Um, it's beautiful and, uh, and it looks cool. It draws a lot of attention, but it's really heavy, right? In your backpack. And nowadays I'm back to the, uh, the Arc'teryx backpack because my wife stole that to me razor backpack I had, but, um, it's really super heavy. You can definitely notice it in there. So I don't know what it is. It's like, like four or five pounds, but whatever. This thing's awesome. It is niche, um, and uh, but it'll play any game. It'll play any game good. Um, the things I don't like about it is, is there's, there's literally like two ports, right? Uh, you've got this uh, USB A on this side, and that's it. This is power. This is volume, and then you've got the USB C or, C or Thunderbolt. And then there, if you open this up, which is I think where you plug in the um, like you could plug it into a better GPU and then there's a, a Thunderbolt in it and that's I just use that for power and I use this for um, for Ethernet right so so I really don't like that it doesn't have uh, ports more ports but I, I get it it's a tablet it's not supposed to have a thousand ports um, my single worst or my single thing I dislike about this most is um, it's only good for if you if you pull the power off um, it goes into this super battery saving mode and um, you can't really do much on it um, and even and, and with super battery saver mode on it it uh, you're still only going to get about two hours max total this is this device has the worst battery I've seen on any device in ever like in, in documented human history it's the worst battery life ever like two hours tops and that's like like not doing anything if, even if you just shut it it's still gonna go, it's still gonna be done in like two and a half, three hours. So, uh, but but it's 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 awesome, right? You can play any game on it. Um, my, only, my only problem, so you can play any game, literally. But like when you're playing like Call of Duty, and uh, it's just a small screen, right? What is that, 14 inch, 13 inch, whatever it is, it, it's just super small, um, but it's awesome. Um, I, I, I like it and I'm glad I purchased it. Um, I can play in, in bed um, because the, the vents are up here. It gets hot and it just blows up here instead of at the bottom. Um, so after, after many months of using it, I still think this is awesome. A little expensive, but man, it's, it, it's got a 4070 and a freaking tablet. Um, this keyboard is less than desirable. Um, so when you're trying to play and you're like, I don't know, it's, it's just whatever. But it's, a good, it's, it's good, I'm glad I got it, it's a little pricey. But anyway, but what I end up playing in the long run is they turn over, and this is that 17-inch uh, uh, razor blade. It's with the 3080, and this is what I play with. This is this is my daily driver. Um, I play on this one, and, and and Call of Duty DMZ is what I've been playing lately. Um, so again, second most powerful. This is this thing's awesome, man. If you can afford one, if you can get one. I recommend it. You can do anything on it. I did change out the uh, the battery. I don't do go with uh, 
I don't go with the game ready drivers. I would go with the uh, studio driver. Um, I don't know how to check that, but yeah, so it's the studio driver, the NVIDIA studio driver. I don't use the game ready driver. Um, it just, I don't notice a difference except for it runs a lot smoother on the game ready driver. So this thing is beautiful. Oh, one other issue is this, uh, this drive, right? It's got like a, you can put a, a micro SD in there. Um, and man, I don't know. They put minimal energy into that because it's like the slowest drive ever. It's like a first gen, um, it's like first gen technology. I don't know. Uh, cause it's slow. Like I throw my, my, uh, my GoPro things in there and, uh, and it just takes forever, but, uh, but this is awesome. I love this, but, but don't buy it if you think that this is going to be a tablet you're going to take and be able to have juice to do anything on. It's, uh, it needs to be plugged in. Uh, like all the time two hours tops and that's that's not processing that's not gaming that's anything that's just two hours max if you're gaming you're probably gonna get like 20 minutes on it battery so uh, but anyway yep yeah. uh, daily driver and I'm still using the um, the cyberpunk mouse it's my favorite mouse uh, my second favorite mouse is the uh, whatever this is uh, the Viper v2 pro I love this one the only thing I don't like about it is there's no color and when I have all the lights out and I go looking for my mouse when it's dark, I can't find this sometimes, but I, but I love it. I put the little uh, sticky things on here. It makes it a little better, but my go-to mouse is this, still this. I did, uh, I did buy this thing, and uh, it's the Basilisk, Basilisk Pro. It's the one with the little puck with the, with the key charging. And man, I've heard a lot of good things about this mouse. But I am not going to tell you anything good about this mouse. Um, I fucking hate this thing. This thing, this is the most inaccurate. Even when you have it fixed, like you can just have it free roll like this. Um, but, even, but you can have it fixed where it click, clicks like that. And this is the most inaccurate mouse. Uh, uh, it's just, it's just, it's not for me. I don't like that style. I like the, it's a little more accurate. So, so I end up using, what is this? This is, uh, I don't even know what this is. But I use this one wired and it does well. Does well. So like I said, second most powerful device right here. Just, it's, it's better than that, I think. And it's better than this. This has got the 30 Ti in it. Uh, but man, my MacBook is still, still outperforms all these other devices, right? Just, just out of the water, nothing, not even close. Um, but the problem with this, and I will never, ever, 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 under any circumstances, buy another device, including something cool like that, that doesn't have ethernet. So I still have to buy, I still have to plug ethernet in it um, because it doesn't have a God, an ethernet port like, like this one does. It's got the ethernet, so, so those are those little things that they don't, that you might miss when you're buying these. But this this Razer 15 inch, um, yeah, this thing is, is in my opinion is is trash. And I would I would trade this if somebody I don't know I just I don't like that because of the no Ethernet. It's it makes such a difference, right? You gotta anyway. Um, so yeah, um, <laughs> I kind of gave up on desktop. Like I still have my, that's that, that's that AMD box. But I don't even have it plugged in. Like I don't even have, I don't even have the power or anything to it. It just kind of sits there. Um, just cause, cause what I do is, is my laptops are enough. So I do have a super powerful laptop and I gave that 3090 box that I, 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 I9 13 gen, I gave it to my daughter. So I still got it somewhere, but I gave it to my daughter. Um, but yeah, I finally got my office back. And, um, and I know everybody was asking about this. I do love it. This is things beautiful. My, like I said, my only complaint is that, uh, yeah, you get like two hours tops bet with battery. Uh, but not, not that you wouldn't just plug it in anyway. But but this thing's, this thing's awesome. I'm glad I bought it. Um, it's not super practical to carry around because it's so heavy. And it's only got a three port. Um, 
but yeah, this thing's awesome. I can play play in bed, but I suck because the screen's so small. When you're playing uh, and uh, and you're trying to shoot and somebody's kind of far away because the screen's so small, there's a, that that time to kill. I I'm always getting my ass handed to me versus a, a bigger screen. Um, on this one, so I t so I tend to always play on this one, but every now and then this one lags a little bit, like the screen freezes in the in the in the main menus, and I get tired of that, and I come and I come play on this one, which is a 15 inch, and um, so I just go back and forth. I go from that device to this device, and when then when I want to work, I go to that device. So MacBook is awesome for work. It does faster and better than any of these devices, including the desktop. Um, that's what I use. So, um, yeah, that's kind of, that's kind of what I haven't really been doing much. I, uh, I've been working a lot, um, and I finally got my office back. And uh, so I might do some videos. I don't know what I'm gonna buy recently. I mean, there's not really any new, new tech that I want. I think the 40 series um, is, super overrated i think my next uh build is going to be an intel arc build um i work for intel so i get i get some uh some early edition type stuff and i think that's what i'm going to do I get some deals on stuff i think that's what i'm going to do is build uh an intel box for my next i'm skipping the 40 series except for this 4070 i got just because it, it it doesn't seem worth it like it's incremental, two percent better, three percent better. That's it's that's not worth spending thousands of dollars, and I can't believe that people still do that. Um, yeah, I, that's about it. I know I should have been putting some videos out, but man, I'm working freaking twelve hours a day, um, and uh, I just don't really have the time, you know, working. And then the, the whole married thing. I've been married for a year now, um, which is cool right i guess and uh but yeah but the most questions come from this device i love it um super glad i bought it and um and i'm always gonna buy these niche things these these cool one-offs that not everybody can get that are just overpowered i, I love it but if you're planning on buying one just know its limitations the three ports you always gotta have battery for battery for it and um I think if you were really going to do some hardcore gaming on it, like real gaming, and like you were like, I don't know, league play or something, you're probably going to want to get a different keyboard or like an extended keyboard, like a, like a 10 key or something like that. Hi, see, I don't even have my, uh, my, uh, my Razer soundbar. I don't even have that hooked up over here because I don't even have that, lap, that desktop hooked up because I just don't, I just don't need it. Um, and I'm, and I'm not. It's almost like I'm in a funk of technology because there's nothing really good out right now. I was looking and I almost bought a, a laptop last night and everything's got a 4060 or a 4070 in it. And, uh, and I saw the Razer with the 16 in, the 16 with the 4090 and it's like 5,000 bucks again. And I'm like, for incremental increase. And uh, I just don't think anybody should have to buy those for... I think I'm going to switch to every couple of years when there's a real difference. So, uh, anyway, that's the, I think that's the newest toy I have. And I think that's the biggest update. Um, it's just a follow up. I use it all the time. Uh, not as much as I should. I actually end up playing Call of Duty on, uh, my 16 or my 15. And, uh, I use this. <laughs> That's YouTube. So, um, yeah, that's that's what I'm doing. Maybe I'll throw some, uh, I don't even know what to do a video on next. Um, I've actually been doing a lot of outside work. I'm in Arizona, and um, I've been taking my Jeep Gladiator out, riding, cruising around. Um, another reason why I didn't turn that down, this, this desktop on, is as I am in Arizona, and it's like 500 degrees every day. And so, anyway, uh, just a, just an update. Um, I haven't gone away or anything. I just I've just been super busy, and I haven't really got any new technology. I haven't got anything new. Um, yeah, nothing new. So, 
so yeah and I haven't had an office this is this is kind of I just got my office back and uh, just finally unpacked but I know I've had a lot of questions about this and um, it's freaking phenomenal it'll literally do anything you want to do but just know that you're always gonna have to have power to it and get a good quality hub because uh, you're not gonna be able to do a lot of peripherals on it so if you want that extra keyboard and stuff um, get, a, get a good hub like even a powered hub would be better. So anyway, uh, yeah, that's about all I got. Cheers.